Hi there, thanks for stopping by. It's Sarah. In today's plan with me, we are going to plan in my social media section of my Franken planner. So I hope you guys enjoy and let's get into it. Okay, so let's get started. Um, I hope you guys don't mind the night filming tonight. It is a night filming session. If you guys are new to my channel, hi, how are you? Thanks so much for stopping by. I'm so glad that you guys took the time out of your day to watch this plan with me. Like I said in the intro, this is my Franken planner. It's kind of a, a goal of mine, but I can't say that I'm gonna stick to it. I just see the new happy planner release and there's some certain layouts that I really wanna try, so I don't know if this is gonna stick. Um, currently, I'm kind of struggling with the, you know, original Happy Planner layout, which is the vertical. Um, I started in 2019 with this vertical layout, but with lines. So it's been a little bit of a struggle. And plus, it, I'm using this layout particularly for my social media. And I can share with you guys a couple of um, pages real quick. And remember this, if you guys saw my video on this tutorial, I still haven't finished my second part two. I have my print my pictures printed, um, so I just need to sit down and make time for that. But I still have that in the works if you guys are interested. Um, for part one, I will leave the video down below. Um, but this first section of my Franken planner is social media. And I'm not really doing with much in the monthlies, just in the weeklies. And this is how I've been having it set up. And then I use like um, smaller paper for um, the minis just to write some notes in there and yeah so I don't know I'm gonna stick to it through this week and then I might switch switch it up I used to do monthly for my social media and the happy planner layouts because I really loved it and here's another example um, but I don't know I don't know it's just been so long since I've used this type of layout I don't know if that makes sense but I just don't know if this layout's working for me with social media is what I'm basically trying to say. So here are the sticker books that I'm using. I'm using journaling. It's kind of more of an add-on accent. Um, my main focus for this theme uh, for the plan with me is the detail florals that came in the bloom box and then everyday uh, mini from Wrong Wrong. I don't know what it is, but Wrong Wrong gives me that vibe or motivation <laughs> sticker book that I need to get through um, some of my social media content, which is with you guys. So I hope you guys have been, you know, enjoying some of the videos that I can put out. Um, I thought I could stick to a schedule at this point. I, I just can't. Um, so I'm putting out there as much as I can. So I hope you guys enjoy some of the videos that I've been putting out. Um, I have been getting a lot of great feedback um, and new subscribers, and I just really enjoy that. So that makes me so happy. Okay, so if you guys are new to my channel, um, I do use the wax paper. However, I don't know if you guys have seen the new spring release and Happy Planner came out with, with this new layover insert. It actually is like pre-punched. I'm kind of curious of what type of material it is. So being on S squad, I hope to get that soon. And hopefully, we're not really sure what we get in our squad boxes. Um, so I hope to get that soon and review that for you guys because I'm really interested because I definitely use this type of planning where I like to prep some of my layouts. It just makes it easier for me. Okay, so I have prepped some of these on wax paper. I mean, I still love the good old wax paper. I probably will use it still. You know, it's essential in my craft space. Um, so I'm gonna set that to the side. And again, this is gonna be before the pen action. I do have some washi um, tape here that I've already set on the paper. Um, this is like a teal with some polka dots. It's from the Encourager washi tape line. Um, and stay tuned for a haul. Oh my gosh. If you're part of the Happy Planner community, you know, you've seen it and heard about it, that there's like, total clearance at Hobby Lobby right now. And it's not just Happy Planner. They have a lot of, I guess they're doing like a spring cleaning thing, but I got some stuff. So stay tuned for a haul. So I was really inspired by these flowers and, you know, hopefully spring's coming around the corner. I know it's different for everyone else. Are you guys still getting snow or maybe on the East Coast? I'm not really sure, but I'm hoping for war warmer weather here. I mean, I can't really com complain, but it's really cold. It's We have like desert weather where it's like 
kind of chilly in the mornings, hot in the afternoon, and then cold at night. I don't know. I'm just ready for some spring and summer. So these florals came from the Detail Florals, and I'm kind of like a hybrid of paper crafter, planning, just cutting up paper and stickers, and um, so where are these stickers? Oh, in the beginning, duh, I knew that. So I like to take some of my stickers and cut them up. So you'll notice that like some of these smaller florals came from like this small section of this sticker. And I think actually this was a sticker, one whole sticker and I cut it in half because here's the other one. Yeah, because we only got two. I wish we got more of this color because it's really pretty. I love the corals and the yellow and like that blue color. So I just took those stickers and um, used them as much as I could in this space here. So how I do my social media is the top portion is Instagram. This middle section is squad and happy planner. So if there's like any squad projects that I have to do, or if there's any like releases of happy planner or anything like lives and stuff, I'll try to put that in there. And then the bottom portion is definitely YouTube. And then, um, this I sometimes leave as notes or I'll put headers for IG squad and um, YouTube. So um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get started. I think I'll just stop, start at the top portion, but actually let me go ahead and cover this notes section. And also with this layout, um, I don't know if you guys checked out my lineup for when I did my 2020 lineup and the planners that I used. This particular layout, it has like this dark green. It each week, it's either each week or um, month, I forget. It alternates colors and it's like this dark forest green. And yeah, I'm just not vibing on that either. So I don't know, I'm, I, I'm leaning really towards um, changing my social media layout. I'm just, I'm not sure on the layout. I'm, I'm just not digging it at all. I don't know. I tried, you know, I, I, I was going to give up in January, but I was like, you know what? I'm just going to like pull through February. And, uh, I've been meaning to also do a flip through. So I will also be doing that. So this is like a little monthly. I don't know if you guys know about Wrong Wrong, but it has this mini one and it's got a lot of smaller stickers in here that you can play with in any of your happy planners, really. Um, but I think that's meant for the monthly. I think it looks cute right there. It doesn't really bother me that I have some space. I like playing with white space, really. You might hear my cat. I'm not really sure if you can. His name is Pumpkin. I have two cats. I, I am a cat mama for sure. I love cats. Okay. So for Instagram, aren't these cute? These little cameras are from the journaling sticker book. You could color them, but I kind of like them black and white with the color. Um, with the colored stickers, I think it gives it a little bit of, I don't know, contrast? No, that's not the right word. I don't know. I just really like it black and white on color. Um, oh, so I was saying on Instagram, mainly I think I've just been writing down what I've been posting and then I'll put like a hashtag to represent what I posted and if I posted. I put a sticker here because I didn't post on Monday. Um... I try to post every day for Instagram because it's a little bit easier, um, but sometimes, um, I guess if you guys don't know me um, or follow me on Instagram, I am a mom of two kids and yeah, so I do mom things that sometimes just takes up the whole day and I go to school at nights, <laughs> so yeah, but back to social media. If you guys are curious, I just try to post every day on Instagram and give it a little hashtag. And yeah, I try to keep it 
simple and sweet. I'm not that Instagrammer who posts like a long blog. <laughs> I just don't. It's only because of my personality and the fact that um, I'm just not a good writer. I like to keep it simple and sweet. <laughs> Okay, so another little trick I do, I've probably mentioned this before, um, so I'm sorry if I repeat it, but just for those who are new to my channel, I love to layer stickers. I think that's fun. So for an example, um, this was a three-tiered box, full box sticker, or half box. It's the boxes that are the same size as in the layout. Um, I'm, I cut this one up, and I like this smaller mini box that says today, and I really want to focus on putting it in the middle for Saturday over here so definitely play with your stickers think of it as paper and just layer and have fun with it um, so I love the color combo so I love that okay so now let's focus on the middle section here which is my squad stuff so for squad, we get projects sent to us, and most of the time it's a theme for each month. And there's 20 of us on squad, and if you guys aren't familiar, Happy Planner has an official squad that's just kind of like a brand ambassador for them to review their products and um, connect with one another, which is really great. Applications are usually in May. Um, I don't have any information on what's coming this May. Um, they really haven't told us anything about that, but our term is up in May. Usually it's just like an application process where you answer questions, you send in um, photos of your Instagram and stuff. But anyways, I, for squad, I put in here projects that um, Hannah gives to us to do. It's kind of like homework, I guess. And I also, for this section, I will put in if one of the squad members um, has a birthday um, or Happy Planner has a new release or Hannah did a live, just stuff like that. Or maybe if we got squad mail boxes and if I have to like review it on Instagram, I, that I love to do that. Actually, I love doing that really. There's like so much joy in that. Uh, okay, so this was my last section here. Something three days out of the week is my main goal video wise I feel like that's all I can do at the moment and because part of social media or just doing this in general also I use my phone for stinking everything and I have to like always make sure I'm deleting photos deleting videos even off even an iMovie or on my um, computer because it just won't take any more, you know, space-wise. I have to do that in between, too, all this. <laughs> so it's it's a lot for doing social media and pictures and videos and editing. And um, it's, it's a lot of work. But I, I love doing it. I just need to be better at time management. Speaking of time management, if you guys know about... Stephanie and her daughter do a podcast, Plan a Happy Life podcast. Um, they talked about that today, and I was like, yay! <laughs> I needed to hear that. So here is my spread, guys. I hope I didn't talk too much through the video. Um, again, if you have any questions about how I plan, definitely in the comments down below. I'm trying to be better at um, answering your comments. I feel like I am. <laughs> if I am, definitely give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I'd love to have you here. Um, but yeah, I, uh, I don't know. What do you guys think? Should I keep doing the vertical layouts or should I switch it up again? Before I, before 2020, I was using the monthly for my social media, which I really liked. And then I was using a mini horizontal on the go a little bit last year too. Maybe I just need to get back. You know, it just takes a little bit to get back at it. But what do you guys think? Should I keep this? 
Thank you so much for um, coming by my video and I will see you all in the next one. Happy planning and take care. Bye.